fighters from Iraqi anti-terror resistance groups have used a new kamikaze drone in its strike against a strategic target in the southernmost part of the 1948 Israeli-occupied territories in response to the regime's relentless offensives on Gaza. The Islamic resistance in Iraq, an umbrella group of anti-terror fighters in a statement published on its Telegram channel, claimed responsibility for an attack on a vital installation in the port of Eilat early on Tuesday. It said the drone strike was carried out in continuation of the struggle against the occupying Israeli regime, in support of Palestinians in Gaza, and in retaliation for the massacres that the usurping Zionist entity is perpetrating against ordinary people, including women, children, and the elderly in the besieged territory. The group noted that it will continue to target and destroy important installations across the occupied lands. The strike marked the first application of al afad suicide drones in operations against Israeli and U.S. interests in the West Asia region. Afad drones resemble the Yemeni Armed Forces' domestically developed and long-range Samad invincible drones. Samad drones are available in three models, all featuring distinctive V-shaped tail fins and a pusher engine. They have a ventral protrusion and wing skids, which they use for taking off and landing. The Islamic resistance in Iraq has been staging many such attacks on Israeli targets since the occupying regime launched a genocidal war on Gaza in early October. Israel waged the atrocious onslaught against the Gaza Strip, targeting hospitals, residences and houses of worship after Palestinian resistance movements launched a surprise attack dubbed Operation Al-Aqsa Storm against the usurping regime on October 7th. At least 35,091 Palestinians have been killed, most of them women and children, and another 78,827 individuals have sustained injuries. More than 1.7 million people have been internally displaced during the war as well.